Well, today on Colorado and Company, we've got a very special treat. We are going to check in with the editor of Denver Life Magazine, Carrie Lee Brown. And we've also got a special guest here with us from Pony Up today, Amanda, who is a bartender there at the awesome bar. So Amanda, we're going to kick it off with you. Let's get into the details about what you guys are offering up over at Pony Up and the special offers you have for our viewers. Yeah, so here at Pony Up right now, we are doing um, to-go food. So you can call in or order online. We're offering that Thursday through Sunday right now uh, from five to nine o'clock. Um, and then starting on June 4th, we will slowly start to actually reopen to guests in-house, which will be so nice. Um, and then the days will stay the same. We'll be doing that Thursday through Sunday and we'll be open from four until midnight. Um, people are definitely used to coming to Pony Up late at night and we wanna keep part of that alive. Yeah, getting that flexibility back in there as we slowly ease back into normal life, whatever that is these days. But to help us cope with a normal life a little bit, we are gonna whip up a very special cocktail today. So tell us what you got. Yeah, so today I'm gonna make the uh, matcha colada. This is inspired by a grande matcha latte, which everyone loves. I think I have one every morning. <laughs> so it is uh, really similar to a pina colada with the addition of some matcha, which I like because it makes it caffeinated. Yeah. Cool. yeah. Little pineapple juice in there. Two types of rum. All right, two types of rum. So you're using the, the dark and the light rum, right? Yeah. I mean, one wouldn't be enough. <laughs> One would not be enough. Well, and everybody loves matcha these days, so this is going to be such a popular cocktail. Yeah, it's super trendy, and I think, you know, it's healthy too, which is cool. Exactly. A little bit of both in that cocktail. So then shake it all up, right? This is going to be a great color of green, I'm sure. Awesome. Well, Amanda, while you're wrapping that up and pouring out that beautiful cocktail for us, why don't you tell us where, how we can order from Pony Up until you guys start to get that reopening, you know, fully underway? Yeah, so it's a Pony Up online store. Dot com. Uh, you can order from us there, or you can, of course, call in and order as well. We can do curbside pickup, or you can come in to the bar and pick up that way as well. So Amanda, that is looking awesome, that bright, fresh green. So tell us what you whipped up here. So this is our Grande Matcha Colada, which you can get um, with any to-go food from Pony Up. We love it. All right, thanks so much for showing us that recipe. Carrie, let's switch it over to you now. We're gonna see so many incredible things in June's issue. So what do you got cooking for us? We're really, really excited about our June issue. Actually, you can see the cover right here. Um, we are featuring Colorado Statecations. So we actually, our main feature well is dedicated to all of the great places around Colorado, from Aspen to Boulder to Denver to Colorado Springs, uh, Vail and even Telluride of all the resorts and all of the things you can look forward to as things start to open up again. So very aspirational piece so that people can kind of start booking and start thinking about where they wanna go after all of this uh, craziness has been going on lately. Yep, and, and aspirational is your vibe. You're always keeping us optimistic about what's coming up next. So if we open up that beautiful magazine of yours, Carrie, which feature are you super excited about this month? Well, I love the feature on the Colorado Statecations because that's a, one of the bigger ones in the actual issue. But one of the ones I want to just mention is kind of going along the themes of the hotels is I did an interview with a valet at the Oxford Hotel in downtown Denver and uh, Stuart Patton. And one of his, the great story about him is that he's worked there for over 25 years. So I really wanted to get an insight, like kind of firsthand um, profile on him, talk to him about what it's like working in the hotel industry in Denver for all that time. Um, so that was a really, really cool interview that I did. That's in the June issue as well. And we also have various other things about um, kids and technology, how much screen yeah. time is too much time nowadays, especially with the kids being online so much for schooling and everything. We also have a feature on meditation, which we thought was really, really applicable right now, just because of everything, um, you know, taking time for ourselves to de-stress, to think about self-care and so there's meditation yeah. tips in there as well so we've put quite a few things we're really excited you really do well we can't wait to crack it open so carrie lee thank you so much and amanda thank you so much for showing us that awesome cocktail over at pony app well, get your hands on June's Denver Life magazine. It's available digitally or for pickup where magazines are sold. Subscribe and start reading at denverlifemagazine.com.